Hey, what up? This is your boy, the Solo Traveler ORD, and thanks again for checking out another one of my videos. And of course, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share, and to hit that bell while you're right here. So I got some information coming out of Rio regarding the, the vaccine passport book. So it looks like um, Brazil, they're adapting, they're adapting the actual passport book for um, to allow residents to move around or, or people to, to visit tourist areas and things of that nature. So here's another country that is implementing this passport um, vaccine passport book, which of course we know that Colombia has just recently um, announced it and they're going to be implementing that out throughout this week. Uh, I'm sorry, maybe this week or next week. I know at the end of the, by the end of this month of November, we know that DR has already done that. Um, who knows what other countries are looking to do that. But this is one of the things that's going on. So Rio has, well, not only Rio, but Sao Paulo uh, and, and all these other places has um, took on this pass, this vaccine passport book as far as using it for their citizens. And of course, you know what that means. That means that we're all going to have to deal with this whenever you're going to certain venues, certain um, establishments and things like that, that this will be something that you're going to need. So it looks like you're going to have to travel with your vaccinated card. Sorry, to hit, sorry for you guys who are have not been vaccinated, but we knew that this was going to happen. So without, without any further ado, let's jump into this article. Let's go into exactly what is going on with this vaccine passport book. So this is from Real Times. It says COVID-19 vaccine passport. Where is it? Where is it mandatory in Brazil? In Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. The requirement works as follow. Only people vaccinated against COVID-19 are allowed access to certain establishment upon presenting proof of vaccination. What is the vaccine passport? By law, municipalities can introduce restrictive measures following their public health uh, realities. Thus, several cities in, in Brazil has implemented the vaccine passport. According to the National Confederation of Municipalities, at least 211 locations have enacted this rule among the brazil capital sao paulo and in rio de janeiro stand out so in sao paulo says here the city the city hall has decreed that shows trade shows conf conferences and games soccer volleyball can only be access accessed by people who have been vaccinated the measure applies to events with over 500 people moreover access is allowed to people with only the first vaccine dose document required is the digital proof of vaccination the issuer the issuer is the federal con con connect sus app or the east Sade sp created by the city of sao paulo finally anyone in the city who wishes to attend events may also pre present a physical document for instance a vaccination certificate or card in rio a decree published in Rio in late August required the, pre the presentation of proof of vaccination. Several venues are bound to demand this for swimming pools, tourist attractions, museums, gyms, movie theaters, and theaters. The following are acceptable. A digital vaccination vaccination card from the Con Connect uh, SUS, a vaccination booklet, or a physical official certificate from Rio Municipal Health Secretariat. In addition, the city determines that the current vaccination calendar must be considered. Therefore, people who are eligible to take the two to take the two doses must provide they have taken the second dose. And you know, I'm not going to continue on with this article. I don't want to bore you guys with this, but there are several other cities here, and I know that a lot of you guys go to um, Salvador as well, uh, Fortaleza, Palmas. So there's a lot of places here that they've um, added as far as the restrictions. So once again, like I was saying, you know, this passport book is not going away. I knew that a lot of countries are going to start adapting this new rule as far as um, making people um, present this as they move around a different location. You know, one thing that I, I was expecting or anticipating was that they were going to restrict people access to their countries. But it appears that they haven't put that in, you know, in writing or anything like that, stating that you cannot enter off being vaccinated, which I find to be kind of interesting that, you know, this country, Colombia, even DR don't even have that. However, it's like you can't even move around the country. What's the point? You know, if you don't have the, the passport book, like you can do several things, but you can't do a lot of things. So it's kind of like, you know, it just doesn't make sense to me that they haven't put that in. I'm not trying to tell them that they should do that, but it's just one of those things that, you know, for people who don't even know about this situation, 
you know they'll go in there you know and get blindsided you know go down there and and find out that they can't move around like how they used to so i think that that we um that's a bad situation but you know just you gotta you gotta basically keep up with the news know what's going on to avoid situations like this but it's your boy the solo traveler ord thanks again for checking out this video don't forget to like subscribe and share and i'm out Thank you.